everyone welcome back out in the field today on this nice day as you can see around me nice clear sky um, testing out the Esheen EV300 and yeah I've just got here and I've realized I thought because I had the Esheen EV200Ds everything would fit you know the antennas and that would be the same but no they are, they're actually opposites obviously on this this one here I don't know if you can see doesn't have the pin sticking out whereas the antennas that I use have the pin sticking out no no they don't have the pin sticking out on the antennas that I use because the machine has on the goggle modules have the pin sticking out so this is what I've been using don't know if you can just see it in there there's no pin so obviously I've been using that on the machine EV200 no problem um, but for some reason obviously I didn't think about it. I just picked the goggles up and thought, right, I'll go flying on this wonderful day. Um, yeah, so that's something to be careful of. Um, luckily, I brought my drone with me. So I did have an antenna. You know, just a single foxy or lollipop thing like that. Just a, just the one antenna on it. I did try and put in a patch antenna on it, just like, you know, putting the faces up. It had signal, but it went down to zero after about 100 metres. So it was like pointless having it on um but yeah for just having that that little lollipop on on its own i was quite impressed it, you know it flew out 450 meters on my, on my big area um quite impressive uh considering <laughs> and if i had that uh the patch antenna on there i imagine it would have gone a bit bit further had better signal and stuff like that I might end up running double patch uh, might get, get one of those uh, ones that you, you sort of fit on the front. Can't remember the name of them, but might try them. I know they're a bit expensive, but everyone seems to have good reviews about them, so probably aim for that. But yeah, this you know the goggles. But flying them because I wear glasses, and like I said on my last video, I've got keratoconus. So you know the Sheen EB two hundreds weren't the best because you got to put the diopter lenses in. These are fantastic. I can just just to focus focus right in see everything obviously the, the difference between these and the 200s on the on-screen display which you'll see in a minute because uh hopefully anyway um if i've recorded the, the flight with the bixler um you'll see the signal strength on the antennas which is actually quite handy because then you realize oh I'm, I'm about to lose range or i'm about to go out of focus or you know you don't want to get the fuzzy screen especially if you're flying a drone with no gps or anything like that but luckily Bixler's got GPS, so it's not a big issue for me. I just flick it to return to home and it'll come back into signal. Um, so yeah, that's a really handy feature. And, you know, just just the whole quality of them. I'm actually, you know, really impressed. So yeah, here's the footage. And if you like what you see, smash the subscribe button. Thank you.